So I'm Nick Cunningham. This is actually my first semester, well, like a year rather, doing this. Um, I've been to a few Cyber 912 competitions. Um, I've done debate recreationally with um, some other schools in my club. Um, I'm a mathematical science major. I study that in statistics. Hi, I'm Katie. I uh, This is actually my first year competing here in Geneva and actually with um, Cyber 912 competitions. So uh, it's been a wonderful experience. Um, as an international relations major, I think cyber is so important to that. So it's been cool to explore this new domain of kind of international relations. Um, and I'm just really grateful for my teammates. Um, kind of, I think we all come from sort of different academic backgrounds. And so we really bounce off of each other and provide a lot of different ideas to come together. So I'm so grateful for all of them. I'm Peter Kim. I'm studying economics and uh, operations research. And uh, I mean, I feel like that's kind of description of our background is that we take the most interdisciplinary approach possible. We have, I mean, Matt's a civil engineering major, Kate is IR, Nick is math and statistics. We have all these different minds coming together. And I mean, sometimes we do clash because there are very different ways of thinking. Uh, we went through the whole, you know, Norman Storm performing phase, but I'd say at the end of the day, like all those different ideas came together and definitely helped us one. Hi, I'm Matt McCarriston. <laughs> uh, I'm a civil engineer at West Point. Uh, I've been doing this for a little bit under a year now, and uh, we won the Best Teamwork Award, which was a huge surprise to the entire team. <laughs> we really had it out when we were figuring out our policy options, but uh, it came together when the briefs had to, had to be done. I felt that we were at a bit of a disadvantage, not really knowing the ins and outs of the European Union and how those agencies go about doing things that for in the U.S., we have federal agencies that, you know, we know the Department of Homeland Security would have been the agency that we would have referred to throughout this exercise. So if I had to give one tip, it would be to thoroughly research, like, the context that you're briefing in because we are briefing members of the European Union, and thus we would have to you know, be really well versed in the legal proceedings and how to actually get stuff done. I feel like as an army, we're kind of shifting perspectives on what cyber is, especially the mindset, culture, and kind of perception of it. Uh, especially coming from West Point, we're very like combat arms uh, heavy in terms of our focus. But doing things like this shows us that we can do things more than just take you know take a rucksack out and march on a hill. We can think also creatively outside the box, both in both types of situations. Uh, so. I think it provides a new opportunity for other people to do things like this in the future. I look forward to cheering on the team from my graduated position as a <laughs> tank platoon leader. Um, so I look forward to you all having fun. Matt, you got anything? I, I, I look forward to immersing myself again in Swiss culture. <laughs> it has been a fun time. <laughs> Switzerland is a great place. I've, I've heard that Geneva is the most fun city in Switzerland, but that is a, not my opinion, that is the opinion of people I've talked to throughout the days. <laughs>